Welcome to the frozen tundra. It is quite literally negative 50 degrees. Where my nostril hairs are frozen right now. Literally, I've been out here for less than a minute and they're already frozen, I can feel them. This is a pot of boiling water. I'll just show you what happens. Three, two, one. But that was really cool. So yeah, I feel kind of weird shoveling this part of my backyard because it's a porch. And I'm only shoveling it because, like, I saw a footprint in my backyard and I thought, that cannot be a bunny. That is not a rabbit. I don't know if it's a possum. Is it a raccoon? Yeah, I was filming back here and I thought, man, I should maybe just shovel a little bit of snow so that creature can kind of come and go as it pleases. Like, let me show you these. <laughs> but do you see that? That is not a footprint. Right here and all the way over there and then back there and, and it just goes all the way back. You know, so I thought I should just shovel for that critter. Wow, okay, <laughs> well, my Joby tripod is garbage. It's literally frozen. You know, if you're like me and you like to make YouTube videos and you just like to create content on the daily, I don't know, I, I feel like I find myself getting uninspired sometimes or not, or not inspired enough. Does that make sense? Well, as I was filming this morning, I thought, how can I make myself, how can I make myself different from the rest of the content creators out there? Or you've thought, I need to get better at creating content. I gotta be different. And that can sometimes play into the comparison game, which I've said in my videos before is just poison. So my thought process after that was, well, how can I make better content? How can I stay inspired to create fresh new content for my channel? And you might be thinking the same, like what could you be doing to make better content on your channel? This Joby tripod is gonna be the death of me. So yeah, I think the main purpose of of content creation is to give the world something to see. Hopefully that, that can inspire and drive others to do the exact same thing or to do something on their own. And that is what I wanna do on YouTube. That's what I wanna do on my Instagram page and Facebook page. Hopefully inspire others to do what they love to do. What I love to do is create content, literally all kinds of content, which is why my Instagram feed is not just like one set this is what I do. I do multiple things and I love all those different things and I want to capture those things and I want to actually implement those things into my vlogs, into my channel, etc. So I think the answer to how do I stay inspired as a content creator? Well, it all boils down to you. What do you love to do? What do you like to do? Pick that thing and then just do it every single day and create content every single day for that one thing, if that makes sense. For example, I am a photographer slash small videographer and I'm getting into the video world. I'm slowly getting there. For starters, I have challenged myself to take a photo every single day and post it to Instagram. And I'm sick of being driven by likes and comments. I'm sick of being driven by other people's acceptance of my content. That is no more in 2019. I'm gonna post the stuff that I like. Even if I don't like it, I'm gonna post it because it's it's me getting better. It's me showing you guys and you guys being on my journey to get better as a photographer, as a videographer, and as a YouTuber. So how do I stay inspired? I do every single day. I create every single day. And I think that is the main answer to how to stay inspired as a content creator. And that's keep on creating. It really is because you won't find that inspiration if you don't do, if you don't edit, if you don't film and post it. Once you do those things and you post it to your feed or to YouTube or wherever it might be, the wheels rolling in your head like, that's the stuff I wanna do. I wanna keep doing that and I'm gonna chase that feeling. I'm gonna chase that content and further curate that content. To answer that question of how to stay inspired as a content creator, well, you just gotta do. Just do it, like Nike. This is not sponsored. 
if, if Nike sponsored this vlog, I mean, that would be amazing. But no, they're not sponsoring this. Yes, just do it. Just create, keep on creating. That should be a shirt. I'm gonna put that on a shirt. I'm gonna put that on a shirt, yes. Keep on creating. That is literally, that has been my motto for the last six months on social. And 2019 is gonna be all of that. Just keep on creating. I think that was good. Hopefully that was good. I hope you guys kind of got a little bit of, you know, a little inspiration from that. Maybe got a little bit of a tidbit to further enhance, you know, your social or your drive and your content creating. So I'm gonna get back to, I'm gonna get back to shoveling my, my little porch for this little critter and I'll catch you next time on the John and Q channel. Peace. All right, little critter, we gotta give you a name as well. Oh, it's so cold.